LPT never, I repeat, never buy cheap tires for your car. As a person who is closely linked to the car industry my number one advice is never to buy cheap tires. I am not saying buy the best tires in the market but buy tires from brands with a great reputation and also good reviews. Take into account that the only thing in contact with the ground is your four tires. It doesn't matter how good you drive, how much horsepower you have, or how powerful your brakes are. If you have bad tires then don't expect much from them. Also, in wet conditions having a good tread pattern is important to evacuate the water from the tire. So there is my advice. If you need to replace the tires in your car and would like to stay alive or uninjured then spending some extra money is worth it. I didn't even know tires came in cheap. This is late and will be buried. But new cheap tires are better than old bald or damaged tires. Some people can't afford good tires. But degraded old tires are way worse than cheap new ones. Edit for better info and details read Baker's Dozen comment below. This is classic advice. But as a total car idiot, I have no sense of what good tires are. Like, the wheels can vary in price quite a bit. Am I being dumb for not buying the most expensive set? Or is there a middle ground? Where once you pass some price threshold you're good to go. Also, I know so little. I have to blindly trust that more expensive directly leads to nicer tires. I wouldn't know if I was getting fleeced by buying a tire that is just marked up in price but performs worse than a cheaper tire. What is cheap tires? I get lowest price from Costco. Is that cheap? Homie is an undercover agent from Big Tire Corp. A. Cheap tires bald tires. We're fucking broke out here dude. LPT never, I repeat, never be poor. I've heard it said spend good money on what goes between you and the ground shoes. Beds. And tires. Sir, I am broke. I will get whatever is legal. I've had my share of Chinese tires and my share of Michelins. I'm aware the Chinese tires aren't as good as Michelins or Goodyear's. But when the product is 40 as expensive and 70 as good, it's kind of a matter of economics. I'm not about to pay $250 per fucking tire for a 275 Fuck that shit. So in which area do you advise cheap stuff? Food? Housing? Holidays? Medicine? Bikes? Once a friend got me the hookup on a set of used tires. I believe it was 100 bucks for four. Several months and several thousand miles later I blew a tire on the highway. Called AAA to change the flat and the tow truck driver tells me that my tires are from 1991 and that he's amazed they even still hold air at all. This was in 2015. Tells me that any of these tires could blow at any time and that it isn't safe to drive. I had literally no money so I said thank you and continued to drive with them for about 8 months. After that, I bought what I would say is cheap tires on my last car. A Taros and they were great. I wouldn't buy used tires from a junkyard. But as long as the new ones are getting good reviews, and if the date on them checks out as not being too old, go for it. I buy used tires from a place down the road. They do custom rims so most tires have 90 tread left on them and the guy warranties them for 10k. Miles 25 the price of new tires. I'd add used ones and refurbished as well. Unfortunately I can only afford cheap tires. Whether I want to or not. Buying even slightly more expensive tires isn't an option. Hope I don't die. Tires. Brakes and lights don't cheap out on the areas of safety. You need all three to quickly stop at night. All areas I upgraded post-purchase. Very useful. You say this. But the I just replaced four tires in my car for $160.
The next known brand would have cost me $510. I beat the shit out my car and it's a beater with a heater and the cheap brands work fine for me. I replace them about every 15 months and it's still cheaper and more efficient than buying the next. Known brand. I've bought nothing but cheap ass all season Douglas tires from Walmart my entire life. I live in Buffalo, New York and have gotten by just fine. I'm poor Sue IDK what to tell you. Wouldn't you have a vested interest in telling people to buy premium tires? Oh I'm sorry. Do you pay the rest of my bills? Get the best you can afford. With the best warranty services you can afford. I've been getting low mid-tier tires from Discount Tire for many years and they have fit the bill. In more ways than one. I will buy the tires that fit my rims and no others. Because only two brands of tire fit my rims one is Continental and I bought the other one. Sound advice. Most car owners don't heed this and end up running through cars because they don't want to put in the right maintenance. It's more costly in the long run and can be unsafe. Knew a guy that wouldn't replace his oil but would just pour new stuff in on top of the schlop. Destroying his poor engine. Suffice to say his car with a V6. Bought brand new. Runs like a decommissioned go-kart. It's a miracle that thing runs. I've paid $1,300 for winter tires this year. Mid-range. And half of that cost was service. I have not had improvement to my traction. Cool I will keep that in mind next time I have to replace my tires and I am weighing it against. Buying groceries or paying a bill. My dad used to say that the money saved on cheap tires should be spent on life insurance because your family will need it. Paying for tires and auto maintenance is the best investment we make. Yokohama Ascend GT is the exact tire you're talking about. I was a little iffy about buying them because they weren't expensive enough they weren't cheap. Either but not premium high performance priced but the reviews were positive and what a game. Changer. For winter tires. Buy the best period. Michelin X Ice. Haka Polita or whatever. Or Bridgestone Blizzik. Dry performance is almost the same between them and lower grade winters but the snow ice. Performance is beyond noticeable. Since we're on the topic of tires. Has anybody here heard of the brand Iron Man and if so what are your thoughts on their tires? Some things you can get the cheapest version of it. But when quality really matters. You get what you pay for. What if I need a set of tires to get my car to the crushers? What are the great brands versus average versus shitty? But what if I am just trying to sail my car and just want to advertise that I have new tires? Please define cheap. I guess while I'm here. I'm getting some Goodyear all-season assurance tires installed TMRW. Had good reviews with a 65k mile warranty and 600 AB seems decent for $144 per tire. Has anyone had this tire? And did it preform as expected? I threw the cheapest tires I could find on my BMW after 3 blew in a month it was an issue with. Something rubbing on the tires. I can't remember what part it was they rode almost the same as the good years I had on. I live in a super snowy part of Canada and did fine through the winter. As an amateur race car driver, I couldn't agree more. They only part of the car that should be touching the racetrack. Pay the extra $30 per tire for the road. I bought the cheapest tires available locally that had good reviews on Tire Rack. Had never heard of Westlake. Yet the reviews were solid and they've lasted way longer than I expected. I have consistently bought the cheapest tires I could find. I am still alive and have never been injured due to an accident caused by cheap tires. Bold of you to assume my four tires are always in contact with the ground. 